Yud is good, yo. It's your boy Todd back here with another video. And in this video today, guys, we're going to be doing a gameplay of the Clutch Time Takeover Reward Pink Diamond, Paul Pierce. Now, before we dive any further into that, how do you get him? Well, you either got to win 30 Clutch Time Offline games or 15 Clutch Time Online games. So I went in here and knocked that out really quickly. And honestly, guys, I'm staying up to date on this. I don't know about you guys, but since Yi Jinlian was so good, I'm staying absolutely up to date on it. So without further ado, Paul Pierce here, 6'7", 30, 35 pounds, 95 three ball, good at driving, Duncan, 90 ball handle, decent defense, 93 perimeter, 84 interior, good steal, decent block as well, 89 speed, 93 lateral quickness, tendency wise, 4 PP, not great, but decent across the board, 9 Hall of Famers, Bully, Agent 3, Amped, Blinders, Catch, Shoot, Clutch, Shooter, Comeback Kid, Hall of Fame, Limitless, as well as Anchor, 33 gold badges as well, which is just absolutely incredible. When it comes down to Paul Pierce, yes, he needs or could use unpluckable, but everything else, the card is fine with. Looking at Paul Pierce here in shoot around, guys, dribble movement, pretty solid. I mean, I'm not going to sit here and gas it and say it's great, but it is pretty solid. As far as his release is concerned, I mean, it's weird. Um, it, it definitely is weird. That, 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 that's as simple as I can say it. It's not horrible, though. Like, it is weird, okay? But it's not horrible. It's got the normal leaner as well. I just don't know what my thoughts are on this release in general. Like, I, I really don't know. It's not, like, great. It's obviously, you know, not the best release in the game. But there are much worse releases. And he does have the normal leaner as well. So, I mean... I don't know. I feel like it's 6-7 at the 2. I get his standing release isn't great, but his drifter is fine. He can move a little bit. His defense is solid. And so I'm going to give the benefit of the doubt to PP right now. Behind the back, let's check it out. Not great. Tween, not bad. Dunking wise, looks okay. And I mean, again, the card is free. You win a few clutch time games, whether it's offline, online, that is a-okay. And all I can say once I get this release down, I think this card's going to be good. Is he going to be the top shooting guard in the game? No. But is he going to be really good? I absolutely believe so. 29-N-O in my team unlimited. I'm going to, I guess, switch my lineup a little bit. I guess, you know what? Whatever. Paul Pierce should just going to be the primary ball handler because in my starting lineup, it's about all I've got. Going to get him involved early and often. Again, I don't know how good I'm going to be with his specific release. So I'm going to try to get a couple of fades and obviously that's where he's going to be at his best if he can fade because his release is not great yo back up is that green no that's a red too yikes man hold up Bailout! Nope. You better come guard me. That's bailout and one. You better step up and come guard me. No, 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 no. Board. Hit him. Hit him. He's open. Hit him. Got him. PP! I missed it, though. I knew I missed it. Oh, that's a good shot, though. Thank you. Run. Thank you. Yo. Thank you. Finally, PP, man. Finally missing dunks and stuff. Yo. That release is so slow, man. Right open. Thank you. Thank you. Finally. He tried pinching from that corner, too. That's a good move, PP. Great move, man. Come on. Got a hedge. Good. You're good. You're good. You're good. Thank you, Pierce Ford. I need one. Thank you. Run. It's a great, great, great play. Run. Hit him. Good. Good to see. 
That's just, I mean, I really am surprised he didn't leave Reem. Oh my gosh, good move. Good move, Paul Pierce, hey. It's a good move. Off board, 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 hit him. Buy him. Yup, it's good offense. This is great offense. Uh oh, hit him. Hit him. Watch this. Let me see this, PP. Let me see it, PP. <sighs> Cookies! I just, I'm not sure about Paul Pierce right now. I just don't know. Because I feel like I've got a fade with everything, and I don't like that. Couple of minutes later, my opponent had had enough. We got him out of there. He quit the game. The big thing that I need to see, just a little bit more of, is I need to see him operate in some space. So we're probably going to head to triple threat online. I see Amy Kobe out here. I don't think my opponent has too good of a squad. Oh my gosh, he has big ha, man. That dude is tough to stop. All I'm going to say. Oh yeah, PP. Let me see something. Let me see something, PP. Let me see. I missed it. Oh my gosh, PP. We've got to figure it out with you. Got to figure it out. Come here. I mean, if he doesn't want to respect me, okay, that's cool. I'll take my three. Like, he just wants to sit paint. That's fine. Yo, PP. Yo, PP. Show me the D. Good D. Half anchor. I dare you. Oh, half anchor. I dare you. That's the thing that he's going to do. You got half anchor, man. You. You're not scoring on something like that. Thank you, PP. Got a little bit of a crab there. Maybe sped it up a little bit. But finally got that green. It's a good shot. Fine. Uh-oh. No way, right? I'm going to say that go in. You might be the go. Nope. Board. I need a board, Bob. Hit him. Hit him. Yo, I don't get it. Yo, that went in? I didn't think any way that would get in. Why does he get these random loadups that are fast? Like, that was a quick release all of a sudden. I'm just confused a little bit. Good shot, though, nonetheless. Oh, yeah, good D. Oh, yeah, good D. Run. It's got to be green, PP. No excuses. Got to be green, and I did. Thank you. Those are the ones I got to green. Simple. If you want him to be great, you got to be able to green those shots. Good steal. Chill. Bailout is so bad. Got to be able to green those consistently. And in Triple Threat Online, he's done exactly that. He's greened all of these shots consistently, and that's what I'm needing out of the card. Ew. Hit him. This, this is the one right here, PP. Green. I mean, that's the thing. I'm in my rhythm now with Paul Pierce. And so everything's going to be green. Before it was ugly because I wasn't in my rhythm. Now I'm in my rhythm with him and he can literally not be stopped. It's it's, it's, it's not a complicated like math problem. It's simple. When you're in your rhythm, oh, I missed it. But when I'm in my rhythm, I'm going to green shots. It's better than 0%. Just so e I missed it. That's fine. Back to him. I thought it was green. I'm confident with PP right now, and I like it. Yep, hit him. Green. Finish him. Again, once I'm confident with him, he's going to be solid. It's just all about getting confident with him. I actually don't mind PP. When I was in Unlimited, I didn't have much room to operate, and my opponent was not bad. You know, those couple of things do kind of go together and matter. The Paul Pierce comparisons you guys need to have is like to Bradley Beals, like those types of cards. And for me, I mean, when it comes down to takeover rewards, we've gotten a lot of them, okay? How does he compare to Buddy Heald, right? He's different than Buddy, okay? He's taller, gonna defend butter, but better. Buddy probably has a little better release, different, right? Paul Pierce compared even to, if, if you wanna go look at the BAM grind and, and who we got in there, better than Glenn Rice, probably better than Michael Red. I mean, Depends on, 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 on what you're wanting. But I do think he is a really solid free shooting guard in my team. Is he going to ever play for me? No. If I got him on my no money spent, would he play over Cam Reddish? I would guess so. So that's kind of where I'm at with Paul Pierce. Very solid. It's just his release that I'm really not in love with. It's going to wrap it up, guys. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. And as always, man, I love you guys. And have a blessed day.